Shalom, 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 family. Give it honor and praise to the Most High. I like to um, report some earthquakes. Um, there was a six point two in Afghanistan. They're, they're saying it's three. Um, a six point one with one hundred and eighty nine kilometers. Um, a six point two, one hundred and seventy two point seven kilometers, and a six point one. Um, 191.19 kilometers. Okay. Um, there also was a forest fire um, in Texas. It was a forest fire in Texas. The fire was originally reported to be about 750 acres, although the service now states it's about 500 acres. How they go down on the numbers, they are known for that. Um, health officials are warning shoppers at South Calgary grocery store that they may have been exposed to the measles. Okay, so these are the boils that come before what? The locusts. The locust. So, measles is a boil. Boils is a part of um, the plagues that are that are on Egypt and the world until they let the Most High's people go. He's going to continue to kill the Gentile nations and suffer them the plagues until they release his children. And um, it's crazy. You're not even safe to go to the grocery store. You know what I'm saying? Rabies. Just this stuff is like rampant. Really rampant. Um, in Portugal, Lisbon, um, a hospital out there reported an outbreak of a bacterial infection. Um, say 800 p patients were estimated to have been treated between the 6th and the 26th of this month. Oh my gosh. In 20 days, 800 people. The symptoms usually appear within two days after the significant exposure of Legionnaire bacteria. Legionnaire's disease can be traced back to plumbing systems where conditions are favorite for Legionnaire growth. This is really gross. Seven people were infected. New York. There was a fire in New York. Five, five fire departments battled a blaze that broke out in a vacant building in Seneca Retreat Center in Lake Ronkonkoma. Tuesday afternoon. The fire on Seneca Road started around 4.30 p.m. The building was fully engulfed in flames when Ron Concoma, the fire department chief Kevin Murray, arrived on the scene. Assistance was called in. Firefighters battled the blaze for well over an hour before it was placed under control. No injuries, so they say. There also was a fire in Indianapolis. A large fire ignited at a warehouse on the east side of Indianapolis Tuesday evening. About 70 firefighters were called um, called to the blaze in the 100 block of S. Sherman Drive near Washington Street about 6.42 p.m. Officials at the scene um, officials at the scene of the two alarm fires said no one was inside the building which is owned by the renovations of the company. There was a helicopter crash in California. So much stuff, man. Crazy. Louisiana. There was an oil spill. 1,260 gallons. How about that? What kind of number is that? 1,260? 1,260? 1260? South China Sea reported a large cargo ship carrying sugar sank damn we need that sugar 
We need that sugar. Give it back. Oh, the good sugar is now in the water. No. The fish aren't ready. <laughs> I hope it's waterproof. Mm. That's not what I'll leave. See, be careful of rats, guys. Be careful of rats. They saying Ebola is back. <laughs> Are that what they say? Between eight to the twenty second of January, the surveillance and health watch mechanism of the center and region reported three deaths in family residing in Yahundi due to acute onset fever, rashes and bleeding. Viral hemorrhage fever. Three people died. That's just crazy. C bio. It's just so much stuff. Okay? It's way too much. So a powdery substance it has leaked. So what's up with all these leaks? <laughs> 